guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tia Cup, not Tia Cup E, or however else you can like pronounce my username. Um, so yeah, I got a new drawing tablet. Um, it's a Huion 13 by 8 inch. Uh, wireless graphics tablet. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not going by a script. So, I got it for my birthday. My birthday was December 14th. Um, yeah. It's, like, lit, because, like, <laughs> I am, you know, one year older. I feel kind of old, but, you know, I was gonna, like, get a tattoo, but, you know, whatever so yeah tattoo or piercing um so basically I was drawing and I actually did not know what I wanted to draw but let me tell you this tablet is way bigger than my last tablet because if you've seen my last video my last tablet was like I think the long like eight by three inches and the 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 square that you can like that is, you know, for the pen, you know, it was so small, like, so small, guys, and sorry if I sound a little gruff, um, I kind of just woke up a little while ago, and I'm just recording this, so I could just, like, hurry up and upload it, because I have finals today, so, and I haven't showered, so I'm kind of dirty right now, <laughs> um, so, yeah, basically, um, what I'm kind of drawing is like, I don't know, I'm kind of ch testing out this new te technique because I really like, you know, curly hair and drawing curly hair, but like I have trouble drawing curly hair. So I'm trying this thing that I've seen a lot of people do when they draw curly hair is um, they do the outline of the hair and then they do like the lines or the squiggles of, you know, clumps of hair and how they would fall. And then they just, you know, color it in. And that's that. So I tried doing that. Um, you'll see later, I actually did not do, the, like, the squiggly lines inside, you know, the outline of the hair. But, yeah. Um, there are uh, 12 hotkeys on the tablet, on the side of the tablet. And I think I programmed uh, eight of them. Right, so, uh, the top left, I believe, alright, so I did, I put undo, redo, um, zoom in, zoom out, um, eraser, uh, brush, um, eyedropper, and magic wand. Yeah, so I don't know how much that was, like, I wasn't keeping track of how many I was talking about, but yeah, so, um, these shortcuts are a lifesaver, and it really does save time and make things easier for me and smoother. So, pretty much, it did the job it was supposed to do. Um, yeah. So, actually, you can see that I'm using the paint, the, the, bu the paint bucket, and I usually don't like use that I'll like cover col color in the place the places I'm trying to color you know I'm sorry for stuttering and stuff this is not scripted I'm being 100% real you guys <laughs> but yeah so you know I found out that you can extend like ex expand like how much the color you know reaches so you know how like a lot of people don't use the bucket tool because it'll leave, you know, white splotches against the line art because it doesn't color in completely. But then I realized you can expand it and that doesn't happen as much. As much, mind you, as much. Like, it still happens in, like, the corners I can't reach, but, you know, it's fine. Um, cleaning up the, like, the coloring is actually kind of therapeutic. Especially if you're just taking your time, listening to some relaxing music. I was actually just, like, <laughs> listening to Markiplier scream in his latest video. 
it was like three scary games and I just watched that <laughs> and I was just like laughing because he's crazy man I love him so much but yeah so this is basically how the hair turned out and I don't know if this irritates a lot of people but like when I color in the eyes I literally like manually color it in I don't use the bucket tool or anything I, I don't know why I just love to do that um, so yeah, um, on my birthday, I had gone out to eat with my mother in the morning and then I came home, um, I straightened up my room and my brother came home cause I have two brothers, right? One of my brothers came home early and I hung with him for a bit and then we went out with my dad for, like, dinner. And then, after that, we went to hang out with my stepsister. Because her birthday was on Sunday. Which is, wait, Friday, December 14th. Saturday, December 15th. Oh, the 16th. Yeah, so... Um, it was a surprise for her, she didn't know. But they had set up, like, a chair... Two chairs with balloons that said happy birthday. I was like, oh, y'all are so sweet. It was cool. It was cool. It was fun. So, yeah. Oh, and I almost got hit by a car. Me and my dad almost got hit by a car. We were crossing the street, and we had the light, mind you. Right? We had the light. And it's really crazy because this car turns the corner super, super fast. Right? And... You know, so my first instinct was to hurry, hurry up and cross the street. So I, like, am about to bolt it across the street. But then my dad, you know, he stops, assuming the guy is just going to, like, go around him. And once he stops and the guy in the car kind of turns his car a little, then I'm like, oh, he's about to go around my dad. So I stop and I backpedal and I'm standing next to my dad. But the guy... He doesn't go around my dad. He goes faster. So I'm like, oh my God, we're about to get hit by a car. We're about to le legitimately die. But then the guy stops. And my dad starts yelling at him like, yo, you don't see us in the street. You don't see us crossing the street. Why are you turning the corner so fast? But of course the guy's windows were like up. So I'm pretty sure he can hear us. But still, like he's dumb for that. What are you doing? Sir. That was really scary. Really scary. But yeah. Like, I really hate when people turn the corners and they're turning it so fast. Like, you're not supposed to be turning like, like you're racing or something. Okay, so back to the drawing. As you can see, I'm trying to color in the lips. And I'm struggling because I'm choosing different colors. I vary between, like, a light orange brown, red, pink, trying to figure out what color looks best for her bottom lip, right? Because I have, like, a fascination with drawing big, beautiful lips. <laughs> so, yeah, I was just like, oh, oh, yeah, you see I'm using red, pink, purple, brown, orange for her lips. And I'm just like, but it doesn't look good because her top lip is, like, solid. It's like a solid brown color so it doesn't look good right so like you'll see me struggle with it like really struggle with it um so then i decided to soften the top lip but not too much that it looks weird and then yeah and then it wouldn't be so i don't know harsh you know and I, as you can see, like, when I colored in her clothes and stuff, I used a lot of mellow tones. Because that's kind of how I dress in real life. Like, I always wear, like, dark clothes. Well, actually, not really. Like, I don't know. During the summertime, I'll still wear dark clothes. Unless I'm, like, in a happy, happy mood. And then I'll just wear just bright, flashy clothes. But every other time, that's, like, once in a while. Every other time, I'm wearing dark clothes, like, black gray and then if it is an actual you know color color 
it's like a darker mellow tone of that color so yeah you'll see I'm, <laughs> I'm like I'm tired <laughs> like uh, I have finals tomorrow I really do have finals today I really do um yeah I drew this I and recorded this yesterday by the way yeah so it really was like 10 something so but thank you so much for watching if you like this video like subscribe hit that bell and leave a comment bye